Hey fellow gamers, it's Cozy Mel here with another Paleo video for you. So here's something embarrassing that I just learned. <laughs> I was talking to Ani and all of a sudden I realized that it wanted me to ask him if he had an overdue library book. And then I realized I had a quest I didn't know I had. So now I've come to Kenyatta. I checked out a history of plants, she says, a few weeks ago, and I guess it's overdue. I loaned it to Nao so he'd have something to read while he sat around at the stables all day. I'm also going to check to see what she wants. She wants some antlers this week because they make great jewelry. And I'm also going to chat with her because I always chat with the NPCs trying to get their levels up. So maybe I can get a Shep someday. <laughs> Anyway, as you can see, the issue we have here is that the quests sometimes are not on your quest board. Sometimes you actually have to go to your UI and look for them. So here we have come to Neo, and I'm going to ask him, hey, have you got an overdue library book? And he says, history of plants. Yeah, Kenyatta lent it to me here. I have it right here, I think. And then we're going to see what he wants as a gift this week. And he wants some quality booster fertilizer. We're going to flirt with him because we just do every time we see the guy. And I'm going to say we make a pretty cute pair. Huh? <laughs> All pun intended. Oh, my goodness. Now, <laughs> he's special, isn't he? <laughs> he says he dug up the wildest carrot the other day and it looked just like the dragon. Um, you don't think that it was actually him, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. Sure do. And I think the phoenix appeared on the wall of my house in the rain the other night. But okay. So, as you can see, the issue is I had a quest I didn't know I had. So if you look at your UI and you hit the exclamation point, you can see all of your quests. And you can only have three on, on your um, screen at one time. So the top right of your screen there's going to be three quests and I didn't choose the quests that are up there. The game chose. Now, if I want to change that, I have to go up here and I have to click on one of these little pins and get rid of that quest because I don't want that on my board right now, for example. So instead I might say, well, I'd like to get this quest done where I have to find this cake and, you know, take it all the way to Bahari or whatever. So I could, click on that pen and then that quest would show up on my screen. But when you get a quest finished, the game automatically throws another one that still needs to be done up onto the screen. And it threw one up there called Overdue Books. Well, the only thing I can think of is that the other day I looked at what gifts some NPCs would want. And I ran into town and I ran up to each of the NPCs. And I was asking them, um, you know, what gift they would want. And then if I had their gift, I was giving them gifts. And I think apparently I must have <laughs> not read very closely when I gave Kaleri her gift. She wanted some um she wanted some flowers to make it smell better in the library because she said it doesn't actually smell like old books. It smells like dirty people. <laughs> Clary. Anyway, I'm pretty sure that's what she said, but apparently I didn't read it closely enough. And she was giving me a quest because I had reached, say, level two with her and I didn't pay attention. And it wasn't on my quest board on my screen. It got thrown into my pile of quests that's under the UI and not necessarily on my screen. So now I have to go find these people. And it was Ani and Gina and Kenyatta. And each of them has an overdue book. But so far, none of them has had the book to give to me. I've had to go get it from someplace else. So now she says, come to think of it, I haven't seen it in a while. I must have left it somewhere by the Phoenix Shrine. Okay, so the Phoenix Shrine is where we were born. So we can go up to the Phoenix Shrine behind the waterfall and go in and maybe we can see if we can find it in there. But um, before we go, I just talk to her because I always talk to her and uh, get all that stuff 
done every day. If I, if I see an NPC each day, I do talk to them. So now we're almost ready to give this back to Kaleri, the librarian behind the desk in the library who gave us this question. I didn't notice it. Oh my gosh, I feel so dumb. Anyway, we'll go see if we can find it up at the Phoenix. Here we are on the map. You can see my little blue arrow. I'm making a circle around it. We are right here. We're going into the Phoenix Falls, just in case you forgot where it is. <laughs> but you know, Kilima Village is down here. It's straight north of Kilima Village. And Mirror Fields is over here to the west and your house is to the east. So, you know, basically that's where we are. There's no map once you get in here. So I wanted to go ahead and show you on the map before we come in. I'm sorry to waste your time while I walk, but okay. So now we don't know if she left it by this Phoenix or if she left it by the Phoenix that's in the back room where the temple is. So the only thing I can think to do is I guess we have to check both places. So I'm kind of just going to look around and see if I, I see a book anywhere, but I don't really see a library book in here. So unless it's outside of this room, which is also possible. Uh, so I'll look outside the room as well, but I'll go ahead and donate to the Phoenix Shrine while I'm here. And that just makes my experience bonus uh, work better. So it just increases how quickly you earn experience. It also means that when you are earning experience, your food, your focus food will go down quicker. Now, I don't see any books just laying around outside of the Phoenix Shrine. Uh, no, not really. So it looks like, oh, wait a minute. There it is. Yay. Okay. I found the book. So now we will go back to downtown Kilima. And what we have done is uh, find the three books. So Kilima Valley Treasures, that was Gina. However, she lost it and we had to go find it. That's how we got that one. The history of plants was Kenyatta. Kenyatta checked it out that she didn't have it. She gave it to Nao. We had to go get it from Nao. This one was Oni. Oni had this book, but he didn't have it on him at the time that I needed to get it back. And he said he needed to finish the book and would I go pick the garlic for his mom while he finished the book. So I did that. So that's part of the quest, I guess. And then went to him and he had garlic for his mom and he finished the book. And so then he gave it to me. So none of them were straightforward. You actually had to do something extra to get each one of them. And now we'll take them back to Kaleri. Now we were back in front of the library right here. And you can see from the big glowing mark that I have a quest to return to Kaleri. So we have completed it. Thank goodness. Since I didn't even know I had it. Oh, here are the books. And she says that they're the ones that she lent out. And, um, you know, if I ever find any extra books, bring them to her. And I said, well, are you looking for something specific? And she says, that's none of your business. <laughs> if you find any extra books, I will compensate you. Bring them to me. Well, okay. Now, so far, I've been playing this game since before the open beta. And I've never found any library books to turn in. Uh, I have found a couple of cookbooks that gave me a recipe. One in the Dayu house and one out in Hodari's house in their kitchens. In case you're looking for an extra recipe, those two are free. You can just pick them up. But other than that, I have not. So um, if I do start finding books that need to be returned to the library, I'll let you know. But I am rather sure that that has more to do with the fact that behind this secret door right here, where it's restricted section and we can't go in yet until we're better friends with Kaleri, I think she has books on flow and magic in there. And so she's probably wanting to make sure she has all the books on flow and magic all to herself. No, no, no. I mean, she has them so they're safe so no one else can get them and use them incorrectly. 
whatever. All right, so that's it. You have done the quest that we did not know we had to get the library books back to Galeri. So hopefully that helps you and you will like and subscribe. Go see Melody Rose Games on YouTube and TikTok and mark that little heart and ring that bell. You know how to do all those things. And I'll see you in the next one.